Oh, looking for a little health news, are you? Or perhaps back for more? Well, today's big story, new guidelines might have us cutting back on our antibiotic use. A good thing? Well, I'll tell you next on Insider's Health News. Well, the FDA works hard to get the levels of antibiotics and hormones down in our beef and pork. A new study about sinus infections is turning the spotlight back on medical consumption. According to new guidelines from infectious disease experts, sinus infections are the fifth leading reason for antibiotic prescriptions. But as many as 98% of cases are caused by viruses, which are, of course, unaffected by antibiotic use. And the overuse of these prescriptions are spurring the development of drug-resistant superbugs that will cause much more damage than a sinus infection. The procedure updates are coming because many people are prescribed an antibiotic as a precautionary measure during a sinus infection. In truth, you shouldn't worry about a bacterial issue unless your symptoms last longer than 10 days, are more severe, including fevers of over 102, and if you're getting worse instead of getting better. For viral infections, you can just take care of yourself and ride it out. No prescriptions needed. So while it's unfortunate that it took so long to discover the truth about sinus infections, at least now we can cut out a large portion of our unnecessary antibiotic use thanks to these new guidelines. Because I don't know about you, but I don't like superbugs. Or most bugs. Ladybugs are cute. Oh, sorry. That wraps it up for this edition of Insider's Health News. This is Kimberly Walston. Stay healthy, my friends.